Happy, the government has automated the seed certification and plant protection process in the country. Denis Otieno has more on these and other stories in our business roundup. Kenya has digitized its seed system in a bid to provide farmers with quality inputs and weed out unscrupulous traders. The system is expected to reduce time and cost in application and issuance of documents by the Kenya Plant Health Inspectorate Service, KEFIS. We are working on a common platform called the Kenya Integrated Agricultural Management Information System where every stakeholder, whether private sector or public sector, will have a common space where all this information can be accessed. Kenya now becomes the third country in Africa after Zambia and South Africa to shift from the manual system to a digital platform. Elsewhere, the government has confirmed the second desert locust invasion in the country. Agriculture PES Amadi Boga confirmed the sighting of the pest on 9th November this year in the lower coastal area. Consumer goods producer Rekit Benkisa has launched a new bathroom cleaner as part of efforts to enable citizens' battle spread of COVID-19. The company's country manager, East Africa Sachin Vama, says the new product will save users the trouble of combining various solutions in removal of stains. Thara hygiene has been touted as key in fighting COVID-19 globally. And finally, the Kenya Wildlife Service, KWS, has launched a campaign dubbed Zuru to encourage domestic tourism in the country. KWS Director General John Waberu says with reduced number of international visitors, demand by local tourists is now key to growing the sector. Actually, the majority of the people, when you ask them, Kenyans, when was the last time you visited a park? They will tell you when they were children, when they visited the orphanage, the Nairobi orphanage. That's the only time. So... We realize then we have an opportunity through this uh, campaign to be able to tell Kenyans, come and visit your parks. There's a lot more than meets the eye when it comes to visiting parks. Denis Otieno, Citizen TV.